Hi everybody, thank you for watching. I am back with another video. I wanted to do like a postnatal favorites video. I figured instead of like sitting down and doing a typical favorites video like I normally do, I would just kind of walk around my house and like point out my must have things that have been super helpful for me post pregnancy. I feel like I've seen so many requests for this type of video and I really quickly want to show you guys what I just found in my kitchen. So basically my house is going up for sale tomorrow and I'm moving. What's so scary to me is like, could that have crawled up into my bed while I was sleeping? So I have my camera on a tripod because when I filmed my closet tour, it was like super shaky and I just don't like that. So this is like a vlog style video, but with a tripod. So as I was listing all the products that I wanted to show, because if I didn't list them, I would forget them. So first things first, I wanted to talk about my postnatal vitamin. When I had the baby, my doctor made it very clear that it was super important to continue taking vitamins because once you have your baby, you want to make sure you're giving your body the essential nutrients. My entire pregnancy, I did take a prenatal vitamin. I did not skip a day. So when he told me that I had to continue taking vitamins after my pregnancy, I was kind of in the market and like looking around and seeing what was the best option for me out there. So I originally heard of the brand Ritual from my mom. She's been on their vitamins for at least two years now and I'm gonna get into why I decided to choose them in a minute, but I wanted to show you. So these are the Ritual Postnatal Vitamins. Two easy to take capsules provide you with 15 essential nutrients that are important for after having your baby. One of the things that really attracted me to this brand was that they were vegan certified sugar-free, non-GMO, allergen-free, and also gluten-free. So I knew that this was a brand that I can trust. They are very transparent when it comes to all of their ingredients that are in each pill. And they're very transparent on where they source their ingredients from. Ritual also does offer a multivitamin for men and women, a teen vitamin, a vitamin for 50 plus, and also prenatal vitamins. What's also really cool about Ritual is it is a delivery subscription service. So it gets delivered right to your door. You never have to worry about running out. What's also really amazing is the ritual bottles are made with a hundred percent recycled material and their mailers are made from recycled newspapers which is just amazing and really good for the environment so if you're pregnant or recently had a baby or if you want to try out any of their other vitamins make sure to use code carly10 for 10 percent off your first three months check out the link below in my description box and again use code carly10 at checkout for 10 percent off your first three months so it's really funny because as i was standing here i found I did a bunch of Polaroids when I was about to have my baby and I just saw this one of me literally in the hospital bed, which I've never shared pictures from that day. I was like, I don't want any photos. I just want Polaroids. And I have, this was from April 2nd. Look how large I was. Here's me and Daphne. So it's funny because I have some footage from the day that I gave birth and not because I wanted to post it, just to have personally. And I see all these people on Instagram where they look so like glammed out, hair done. My water broke at like midnight and the last thing on my mind was let me go get ready. So I literally looked crazy, all kinds of crazy. So I give a lot of credit to the moms that actually spend the time to get ready. I guess for me, it was like not planned to be that day. It was, I think I was like a little over a week early. So I was like not prepared at all, but it's, I'm happy at least I have these Polaroids like from my memories. So my diaper bag was just sitting right there on the table. So I figured I would grab this next. This is a portable changing pad and this has been extremely helpful for me. I keep it right in my diaper bag and when you open it up, this is what it looks like. So I keep, usually I'll put a diaper in here in this section, just one, because if it's too like fat, it doesn't fit nicely. Um, I have diaper cream, which the one that I really like is the triple paste ointment. And I will put the wipes in there if they're not like really full, because when the wipes are really full, again, this thing becomes too thick. Um, and then this part opens up into a changing table like pad, like wipeable, and then there's like a little cushion in here for their head. So when I go out in public, this thing is like probably one of my most used items. And again, if it's right in the diaper bag, which is amazing. You guys hear him in the background? Right, moving on. I love you. So it's a little chaotic in the kitchen. Had a busy, busy morning. But I wanted to next talk about the dish soap that I use for all of his bottles and pacifiers and basically everything. This is the Dapple Baby Dish Soap. I've probably gone through like four of these already. Highly recommend it. And I also have the mini size. 
I gotta go get rinse. I have the mini size that I keep in my diaper bag as well. That way if I ever have to wash the bottles on the go. So for bottles, Como Tomo is my favorite. I have both sizes. These, I just love how soft they are. They have been my favorite since the beginning. So when I pump, I give it to him in here. I think I'm gonna stop at six months. That's the plan, but I don't know. I'm mixed, I'm mixed emotions about it. Breastfeeding has definitely been a journey, but knowing how good it was for Lorenzo is what helped me push through it. I'm gonna go grab him really quick. I want you guys to say hi. I'm doing a postpartum video which you definitely need to be a part of, my little postpartum present. Say hi, world. I'm doing just great. I'm wearing my MTV shirt, music, television. So I have these glass jars. This is what I store when I pump my milk in. I did this over the bags um, because they're reusable and I just found it easier. So these I got right on Amazon. And then I also got one of these black carriers that you put an ice pack in. It comes with the ice pack. So if I'm traveling with my breast milk, I can put it in here. So this I think is also super important for those of you guys breastfeeding. Obviously if you're not, you could just throw like bottles and formula in your um, diaper bag. But I wanted to show you guys that. And then making our way downtown, walking fast. All right, so the baby Brezza. This is a sanitizer for bottles, pacifiers, breast pump parts, all that. It sanitizes and dries everything. I use this three times a day, every day. Um, probably one of my most used things. And I think I mentioned these in my last video, the LV pumps. I love these. I use these almost every day as well. Sometimes though, I still do use my Medela. You can see it back there, the Medela pump. That was the one I was using at first, but I found it to be like, you know, you have to kind of sit still while these you can just kind of put in your bra and move around and do things, which is really nice. Quick clean bags that came with the Medela, Medela pump. I do do this for quick sanitation. You put it in, put two ounces of water, 90 seconds in the microwave. These are really good for fast sanitizing. Um, but usually I don't really need anything that quickly and I'll just throw everything in the baby Brezza. So whichever your preference is. Did you poop? Oh, I think he pooped. All right, I'll be right back. <laughs> Oh, hello, cute stuff. Quick, <coughs> Sophie, if he's crying in the car seat, Sophie makes him stop crying. So it's like a little um, teething toy. And then his bunny. I don't remember where I got this, but the little like loveys with the animal head and the soft, he falls asleep with this almost every single day. So he loves it. <coughs> you see Sophie? Here you go. Oh. This is my car seat. This is the Nuna one, it's the Nuna Light, and when I tell you, I went to the store, uh, Bambi Baby, and I tried all of, like carrying all of the car seats. This one is significantly lighter. When he was a newborn, I mean, I'm sure I could have used any of the car seats, but he's heavy now, he's close to 20 pounds, and this one I highly recommend because it's the lightest one out there on the market. If you guys have a Bambi Baby by you, like they're amazing, the store is amazing, but they also have an online. And I do have a code for anyone interested. I will list all of that below. This car seat is good for, I don't know, up until, I forget exactly how long, but we're gonna switch it out soon. My sister just switched to the other car seat um, recently and her son is nine months. So I have to let you know on what car seat I decide next. I'm probably gonna stick with Nuna. I really like the brand. So, hello cutie. I wanted to show this little high chair thing that uh, goes onto the table. It's very secure, so you don't have to worry. Um, oh, hello Cindy. So how cute is this? You love it? <laughs> as far as his bathtub, this is the one that I love, he loves. I had a different one that I got rid of because he was not happy. Now he really loves tubs and I don't know if it's because of this or what, but I have um, this little guy that I fill up with water, the little sponge, which I love. And as far as wash, I put a couple pumps of this in the water and then I also use this to wash his hair and his body. And I did also just get the Kylie haven't tried it yet, but she did send me the PR package, so I will let you guys know about that. But I put this right in my kitchen sink. Right now I store it in my, um, what's it called? Laundry room. Hello, Benjamin. Hello, my little Benjamin. <laughs> Hiya. Hi, baby. So this mat is literally his favorite. My mom has it. Oh, no, don't cry. My mom had it at her house, and he loved it so much I had to get it. 
So it's super colorful and he just really, really loves it. So this is definitely a necessity, a mat. And the pillow that he's on is amazing as well to help prevent a flat head. I know you took my sock off and now you want to play. This guy is for diapers. Amazing. It's by Ubi, I believe. And it traps like the smell in there, which is are just starting to smell. And then this baby Bajorn bouncer with the toys I have up here because when I get ready, gotta plop him in something. So he really loves this, keeps him busy. I also put this next to my shower when I have to shower. So it's good to have something you can trust while you're watching him to plop him in um, to get some things done. So that is it as far as my postnatal favorites, must-haves. Just off the top of my head, I figured it would be better by just kind of walking through the house and seeing what's out and what I use every single day. I hope this video was helpful. I hope it was a little more fun to watch than just me sitting down talking about the products. I thought it would make it more like a vlog style video, which I know you guys really like. I am gonna go feed this little baby and that is my plan. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I love you so much. And until next time, see you guys later.